Welcome everybody, this is Legion Incorporated. Thank you for joining my channel today. We're going to be playing a little bit of normal draft pick League of Legends. And back to my party, we have Fatal Burba or Fat Al Burba, his choice. And then we have Sarso, but I'm just going to be calling him Decay for the purposes of it's a lot easier to remember. That was Decay. <laughs> and that's fatal. All right, so we're ready to start on uh, Decay's uh, start. So I've been doing really good on my um, ADC runs recently on this draft pick. Out of my last 20 matches, I have... Let's see, four defeats and two remakes. And of course, we're sitting waiting for a match. <laughs> waiting for a match at the moment. Fatal is going to be my support today. I am running bot lane, and then Decay is tending to uh, go middle. Going for the mean machine. Let's go. Admittedly, Tristana has been one of my strongest uh, ADCs in recent games, beating champions that I didn't think we were going to beat. Um, I had a match earlier, uh, yesterday I believe, where we were, as a team, 4 kills to 12 kills. They had just completely wiped the beginning of the game. And with Tristana, I ended up getting extremely positive in that match and, and doing very, very well. They picked two of my favorite supports. Morgana and Leona. I can't uh, meme this. Do you have a do you have a healer? I wanted to meme it. <laughs> he's uh, he's also an excellent uh, support. Um, right now I <laughs> right now I have a few friends that are just really really good supports. Uh, my friend Rick, uh, also Zeus Prodigy. Also, um, Matthias Thoman or Lord Garrix, he's been doing some pretty, pretty good uh, matches of support recently as well. And then we also have Sarso and my friend Grimm, and then uh, Fatal Burba, also all, all wonderful supports, but also have their own roles in other lanes as well. Should I just go really mean and just do this? That's what I've been having. Um, uh, Lord Garrick's do. Uh, if he's not Yumi, he's Morgana. If he's not Morgana, he's Lux. So. Yeah, we'll just, <laughs> we'll just be mean. Elementalist or Stark? Elementalist. And I honestly have to say, hopefully you stick around long enough or are able to come back later. Um, because if, uh, if he's around when you're using that, he's going to just freak. Because he's been trying to get me to get it for him. Garrix? Yeah, he wants that skin. Well, yeah, no shit. It's like one of the best skins in the fucking game. <laughs> yeah, it is easily, and it's expensive. Mm -hmm. I got it right after it came out. I got really excited because I, in that package, I ended up getting it um, in uh, one of the orbs. I got a skin and I got a gemstone, and then I used the gemstone to. Yeah. Get a chest, unlock that chest, and got an astronaut Tiana. Those are nice. Nice. Here, their masteries are well, Kha'Zix and Maokai. I actually Kha'Zix already owned five. it and didn't realize it. So right now, this is what he's talking about. Their Maokai is mastery level four. They have levels on their side. Mastery level five for their Kha'Zix, and their levels are pretty much the same. Uh, but they have way better masteries though. But we have. Yep. We're going up 
against bot, though. That's a question. Wait. Who are we fighting on bot? Our bot lane is probably going to be, my assumption, Bard. Bard for sure, but I would guess Kanan. But they've, I've seen a lot of off-meta bottoms recently. Uh, one that I see very commonly is either um, uh, any radius ADC randomly, but Sienna. Sienna and an ADC tends to be something I'm seeing a lot of right now. Um, I pretty much saw her as an ADC primarily, but she's so also a support. We have a lot of punish. I think this match is going to go in our favor pretty quickly. Um, oh yeah. Between Akali, which I know Decay does a good Akali, um, as well as Lux and Tristana. I don't really care about Timo or Volibear. They're just basically to annoy people, both of them. And we. Volibear will be good at ganking. Right. Yeah, you know, he has a good speed increase, so he can come into lane when needed really oh. easily. Um, so bear with me, as I'm going to be super rusty. Oh, no worries. As long as you do better on allowing me to the creep kills, I'll be okay. Oh, I don't care about that. That's, that's the easy part. The hard part is not dying constantly. Just more or less stay behind me and focus on poking them. That's what I expect to see. And the other part of this is... Uh, um, Lord Garrix, he has a really bad tendency to try to take minion kills, and I just I learned to ignore it and stop talking about it, because I can still do good even outside of him taking half of the creeps. Starting items is nice. I forgot everybody camps in fucking mid bush. He wants to invade, is what it looks like. I'm down with giving it a shot. I haven't done anything like this in a while. He's calling for mid. I don't have my Q on a quick cast. Nice. Well, that was a nice punch. They're just like they're doing anyways. Q on quick cast. There we go. Well, I'm, see, I'm going to help him do whatever it is over here. They're probably going to go for our blue with you doing this. So, or with him doing this. Saw Cannon over here, so he's already back in lane. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Go for him. Go for him. Do it. I dare you. He won't. He won't. Well, having me fed early game is never, ever a good thing. I just keep annoying him. He seems to turn to not focus on you, but me. Which is fine. <laughs> well, you are a sister. That's true. This explains so much. I'm gonna back off. They're gonna probably get ready to push a little bit. Maybe drag him out a little. I'm gonna. Oh, I don't have a ward right now. I was gonna put a ward. Yeah, don't worry about it. In the jungle bush. I doubt their jungler could do anything to actually be able to get me, but. We just need to pull him out of tower. Ouch. This dancing, like, up my, uh... 
is an okay yeah, yellow. I'm really good at staying low health, that's the sad thing, so I don't really care. Oh, here comes Kyle. Basically, so everybody knows what I try to do with almost any of my ADCs is I keep harassment on the enemy, but I don't really go for kills unless I know I can get them or had a really good chance of getting them. Um, I even, you know, have no problem dying occasionally if the kill is going to be worth it. Um, something. He's like, he keeps trying to come in to get his CS, and then they just chase him, he's like, nope. Um, so everybody knows who's watching, if you haven't seen League in the years it's been out. Um, Bard and Lux actually both have very similar stuns. The difference being, um, Lux only has to hit one person, she doesn't have to hit two but she can stun two. Where Bard, he has to hit two people to do any kind of stun. Otherwise, I believe it's just a simple st slow. They have a ward there. Oh, damn it. Oh, I did get him. Ah, uh -huh, nice. Again, I can't stress enough, you gotta try to focus on your last hitting of minions. I'm still trying to work on it. I'm pretty good most of the time, especially later on. But at the beginning, I have some trouble if I'm doing low damage. I'll just underestimated or overestimated. Rick gets like as many CS as I do. He actively tries to take them from me. And I still do extremely good as uh, ADC. Exactly. That's why he does it. He doesn't take it. Okay, how did that not hit him? I'm still wow, very my Q just, just didn't want to go off there. Couldn't save me. I think it's the top time we shit on them, and they just go ahead and back. Well, land a stun, then I might consider it. That's what I'm trying. <laughs> I got one on the bard earlier, but you were running. And I don't like wasting my jumps unless I have to. Either for a really good do uh, uh, not dodge, but really good um, engage. Oh yeah, that did a whole bunch of stuff for us guys. I know they're getting pretty hungry considering I've already got two kills. They're gonna get ready for ults in a minute or two, so we want to engage them before that happens. I have ults. Oh, uh, I was I was trying. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> All right. Well, we shut them down in the early game, so this is fine. Yeah, I actually don't even worry about it. Like, there's been a couple times where I've been three or like one and three or whatever, and I still turn around and just absolutely annihilate them. I just focus. I do not leave my bottom lane until I get that tower with the exception of helping with Dragon, which it looks like we're looking at an invade of Dragon pretty soon. So I'm on my... Yeah, just gonna chill, so, uh, 
Yeah, pretty much it looks like he's just harassing them. Uh, expect them in this bush. That's helpful, Dragon. It's a good time for it. Okay. I'll go ahead and cover back in then. So this game is starting out strong. Um, right about 10 minutes, we have three kills, one death, three assists on our ADC with a overall of 10 kills uh, uh, versus four ki uh, kills on the enemy team. And four. <laughs> I am in the lead for deaths right now. <laughs> Perfectly fine. We're completely destroying them in jungle. Bot and uh, doing... And we're holding top. So we gotta snowball really hard. Nice. Getting some harassment damage in there. All I have to do is let them push out a little bit, and I can jump back and try to ult them back into you. That's if you saw what I did earlier. They basically did nothing to me. No, I didn't. I didn't know. Oh, I think. I'm not sure. At least the minions are nice enough to tell you. Aggressiveness to try to save the tower is allowing me to do some major damage to him. Now we can just destroy the tower. Can you get him? Oh shit. That was an auto for the record. No worries. If he dies to an auto, it's worth you taking it. Alright, it's a good time to back. I only have, you know, 2,300 more. Oh, interesting. Deploying a ward does not interrupt recall. Hmm. Remember that. Oh, that, that brings me up to a less than 13 minute Infinity Edge, Dorn Blade, Berserker Grief combination. Um, considering what they are building, I think after Infinity Edge, I'm just going to build a Bloodthirster to get that lifesteal, so I have more presence in lane. Um, How are you doing in your lane? Um, I'm doing alright. He's a little bit difficult to deal with, but me and Bali have been kind of teaming up. And the last few times I've had no problem with myself. Yeah, that early gank while he gave us is just completely grilled on too. Oh, does he want to hold? He wants to hold. Did you get him? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh, shit. How did that hit you? Hit 
<clears throat> I actually don't know what hit me because I splashed and jumped out of the way, so... Yeah, it was Maokai's old. I still flashed and jumped, I just don't, I don't get where that still got me. Yeah. I didn't even realize what was happening. I didn't know that he was there. Getting props for that, uh, ball bear, what? He has his he has his uh, ability, so that's what he's trying to go off of. Uh, he, he ain't gonna make it. Not this time. Yeah, I don't know why he turned that way. Oh, uh, they're they're gonna do drag. That's probably what he was going on about. And this is an, an yeah. infernal, so I really would like to stop them. And missing at all cost them a tower. Two people. Yeah. We can get we can get this. Once you guys finish doing gank in mid. Very, very nice. I didn't want to go mean well. I was in trouble and then I was like, oh. Let's get drag, come on. Let's get drag. Let's get drag. Wait, are, are we going Herald or drag? Nope. Oh. No. Okay. We, everybody, are going to win. Early game, uh, five man surrender on the enemy team. I think we just took them to town. That was pretty spicy. All right, thank you everybody for joining us on that match of League. Uh, this is Legion Incorporated, and we will see you again soon.